Hello friends, welcome again. This is my new project, Online Grocery Store. I am using latest PHP version 8 and the MySQL version is also 8. This is a bootstrap theme. And we have used the Visual Studio Code ID. So, this technology stacks we have used for development this project. This is a responsive theme. This is a mobile version of website. So this is all of the mobile version you can see. Now let's start the functionality of the project. Our project title is online grocery store and we have developed this project with two different types of interface that is front end face and the second one is admin interface. Both are totally different interface but both are responsive and we are using bootstrap latest version. This is a major project and from this project you can learn a lot of things means how can you create the database, how can you manage the database, data from the PHP with CRUD application like a create, update and delete. Many of the things you can learn. Let's start the features that we have developed inside the project. Okay. Now this is a home page. Now you can click on category. You can check all listing category here. If you click on pulses, you can see all the products are visible in listed the categories. Then you can see all of the products are coming here. These are coming from the database. This is a header search bar. You can search anything from here. You can see we have three images for sliding. If you click now, we have added three images. Now, this is all about the home page. You can see it's sliding. It's sliding. So we have added the slider here. We tried to make this project more functional, more operational. We have used a lot of plugins to develop this project. This is an about us page. It is a totally static page. Nothing dynamics in this page. This is a, all of the products which are available in database. You can see. If you click on the view details, you can check the product details from here. So this is all of the categories. We have added eight ad categories, but this is a dynamic. So you can add number of categories from the database, from the admin panel. We have separate admin panel for that. If you click on categories like pulses, you can see four products contains in categories of pulses. So now this is a registration phase. Here user can register. This is a login page. And this is a contact us phase. It's, it's a totally static, but we have integrate a small map, a small real map. You can check.
So I have integrated here. So if I buy some products, you can add number of items like if I want to buy namkin, you can add number of items in add to cart option, you can check. You can say there. Now click on the add to cart. So there is a restriction. Without login, you can't buy the product. So you must have the user account on this portal for buying any products related to grocery. Without account, you cannot buy anything. So the user ID is and the amit at the red gmail.com and the password is text on login to account. You can see the user dashboard is open. Now we are going in shopping and now we click on like a numkins. You can add two items and the add to cart. You can see two items coming here and the total amounts get calculating automatically. And the total amount, that much amount you need to pay. Now click on the proceed to checkout. After that, you will able to see payment page. This is a dummy page, not a real payment. You can enter any fake card number like this thing. Card name, master, spidey date. And the click on the make payment option. You can see your payment has been done and this order summary. You can see your order summary, order from the order summary. Your order is confirmed. User can see his or her order details from the my order section. You have to see your total order 22, confirm order 22 in transit. If you want to see details of the your products, you can click on the eye icon. You can see the your order summary details. So again, coming on the dashboard. dashboard page this is a dashboard page user dashboard you can see all of the order details and the important links is here either you can go on this page from this or other clicking on this page like uh, all products you can go from here here directly This is a my account page. User can update his details from here. And this is a change password page. Here user can easily update his password also. This is all about the, this is all about the front end. Thing. Then that one last thing I want to tell you this is a session drive. 
you can see this administration option is showing logout option dashboard option showing if i log out then you can see menu has been changed because of the session you can see all the menu all the upper menu has been changed so this is all about the front end panel and what we developed inside this project now comes on the admin panel for admin you need to open first admin panel you need to login first right so without login you can't access internal page so the admin user is admin at the rate gmail.com admin at the rate gmail.com and the password is test now login oh wow this is a very attractive and great dashboard we have created for the admin panel here you can see the totals order total delivered confirm orders order in transit you can see everything from here so this is a dashboard even this dashboard is a drag and drop thing you can minimize also like a quick menu you can maximize like this this is a quick menu option you can minimize or maximize anything this is a quick menu from here you can go on the page like all products you can go from there directly if you click menu now here menu will be hide like this this is the view of the page after hiding the menu but if you don't want to hide this is so click on so this is the main options dashboard product management category management order management customer management change password logout this is you click you can check the first going to add to products this is a add to products page here admin can easily add the products now this is a product report page this is all products when you can edit it from here like this you can edit you can see this all of the products what we have added there is a pagination you can say there is a basic pagination here if you can and you if you can edit products you click on the edit button product will be open in the edit format then you can edit and this is the product report this is the product report you can see the product report export in the excel as well as csv as well as pdf if you want disable or visible enable the columns from it you can do like this code enable 
like this. If you want types will not visible, then you can see. Then you can see type is not coming here. But if you click on type, then types is visible here. So this is the power of table. Same for the category management, add to category. Here admin can add new category like a category descriptions images and save the data. This is all about the category report. You can edit from here, edit, delete from here. You can see category, this category in edit format. And you can also export the category report in CSV as well as Excel as well as PDF. So now click on the order management. Here admin can see all other details. So order management. Order is confirmed. This is order management. You all you will be able to see all of the orders. You can see there is a pagination. It's working perfectly. Click on the view. You will be able to see the order summary. If you want to order status, your order status will be canceled. You can do from here like this. Your order status has been cancelled. Now this is a customer management and here admin can add the new user and admin can this is a user report page here admin can edit or delete easily customer from this page. This is a change password option page. Here admin can easily update his password. So this is a logout page. Here can admin easily log out. So this is the admin panel. You can see the view of admin panel and also the view of user panel. So we have to develop these two different types of view for the managing this whole project. So this is all features we have developed inside the project. If you need any type of enhancement, any feature, just put it into comment box. We, have, we will develop this project according to your requirement. Please don't forget subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you very much.